What's up, my friends? What's in the basket today? What do you do or say when you know someone is making horrible life choices? Uh, this is so tough. Uh, and I get asked these kinds of questions a lot because as you start working on yourself, as you start growing, you sort of immediately recognize who's not taking those steps and you just want them to, right? Like, ah, oh, I've been doing this thing and it's been working so well. So if, if they could just do it, then they would be great. And um, unfortunately, there's very little that we can do to change the behaviors of others. I know that's a really frustrating answer, but it's the answer I always give because it's true. So you can live your own life. You can model the behaviors that you want uh, to kind of speak into the world, right? Your actions are always speaking the loudest. And if other people uh, see you living in a way that is healthy and beneficial, perhaps they pick up some habits from you. We're always influencing each other more than we realize. So don't underestimate your influence just because it's not happening in huge and immediate ways. Change takes time and everybody changes at their own pace. But what you don't wanna do is come in and be harsh or judgmental on uh, the person that you see making the, the horrible life choices. Well, you gotta do this and if you just do that, if you, when we get attacked like that, we push back, we shut down, we, we defend uh, the behaviors that we're engaged in. So we're less likely to change now, right? Because the walls are up and we're on the defense. So as hard as it is, you wanna be loving and accepting no matter what choices people are making. And then when you have your moment, and you really don't have a moment until somebody asks you, right? If they ask you, so, so what do you think I should do? Or, you know, I've been considering this change and what do you think about it? Then, then you have your moment, but you still got to lead with compassion and patience. And that's like, oh God, finally, let me tell you everything you're f***ing up, right? So uh, this can be really difficult, but just kindness, compassion, patience. Uh, this is the way to do this, non-judgment. And so I know that's really, really hard, but ultimately, you know, one of your best gifts to the world is just becoming the best you. So I invite you to continue to keep the focus there rather than, uh, you know, turning it outward and thinking about other people's shortcomings. Just keep becoming the best you that you can. And I think you'll be amazed how many opportunities you have to influence people in small and major ways, just leading with that kindness, not even necessarily with an agenda to change people. It'll just slowly start to happen. So take that pressure off of yourself. Uh, there's no magic wand here keeping an awesome human and uh, we'll see what happens with the rest of the world. I appreciate you asking if other people have thoughts. Of course, I invite you to share them down below and I'll see you back here next time.